Uh, basically, we were called up by Shell Oil Corporation. Uh, they tasked us out to help support the Kulik oil rig uh, in getting a couple real heavy sling loads onto the deck to support recovery operations. Uh, basically, that included getting a 11,000 pound generator on board as well as a 16,000 pound compressor to aid in the restoration of the Kulik. Uh, everyone that we asked for support throughout this entire operation was more than happy to bend over backwards for us, uh, especially the Coast Guard, uh, in hangering our birds for you know, four days. That was, that's crucial right there. Well, on the first day we tested our uh, sling loads and one of the loads was a little bit too heavy for our aircraft, so we had to download some of our internal equipment uh, to uh, continue on with the mission. And once we continued with that, staging and the weather was a big problem for us to complete our mission in a good, timely manner. But once the weather cleared up, we were able to uh, take both packages out and set them on the culling. Well, I think it worked smoothly because in the end we got both the, the generator and the compressor onto the Kolik almost effortlessly with no one hurt and both aircrafts back here, so I'm, I'm very happy with that. But we're pretty lucky. We have a very experienced crews in the cockpit and also in the back. Combat has actually taught us that um, the mission's going to change at all times, so we were prepared for that and it was really easy to come up with contingency plans as they were happening to make sure the mission got done. I'm really glad that the Sugar Bears were given this chance to help out our home state of Alaska.